Hello everyone, this is Yvonne with Trucking Up 404. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to find loads for a box truck, a splinter van, and a cargo van. Now the very first thing you need to do, you need to click on the blue circle with the plus sign. Click on new search. Um, click on the origin. Um, I'm just going to choose a state, so I'm going to click on state tab. I'm going to click on California. Click done. The destination in this video, I'm going to leave blank. If your carrier um, likes to travel um, throughout the state, just leave it blank. If your carrier has a destination he or she would like to go to, you just click on the destination. You type in the city or you click on the state tab and you select the state. Now, um, as far as the uh, truck type, um, the first example, I'm going to show you how to um, find um, loads for a a cargo van or either a splinter van so you need to click on van and standard and you also need to click on s as a um, van for specialized and then click done you should see a vs in the uh, truck type now the length i'm going to put in 10 the weight i'm going to put in 5000 full or partial i'm going to put um both the start date, I'm going to leave it as today's date. The end date, I'm just going to go two days out. And then I'm going to click on search. Here you will see all the loads that are currently available. I should say showing currently available. And what you do, if you see a load that you are um, interested in um, for your carrier, what you do, you go ahead and click on it. And then the broker's information will appear. And then you will, have, you will see the doc number, which is the MC number, and you will see their contact information. Now, for me, what I like to do, I like to look at the broker's review um, and see what people um, are saying about the broker, broker. So let's go ahead and click on the review. Here you will see the different reviews that P, um, carriers or um, has posted about this particular broker. And also, if I stroll up, you will see the broker's number. You click on the Brokers tab, and you can see the additional information about the broker. Now, let's go back. My next search, I'm going to search for a box truck. So, cl click on the blue circle with the plus sign again. Click on New Search. The origin, let me click on State. Let's do Connecticut. Click on Done. And I'm going to leave the destination blank again and the truck type i'm going to continue to um, have v for van standard and s for van uh, specialized and click done so for the box truck i'm going to put in 26 length and the weight i'm going to put in um, let's put in around eight thousand i'm gonna put i'm gonna leave it as both the start date, I'm going to leave it as a, um, 12 14. The end date, I'm going to go a couple of more days out. Let's say December the 19th. Click on the search. Now you can see there's, um, there's several different loads that are currently available. And what you need to do again, you need to just click on um, the load that you're potentially interested in. You need to contact the broker. You need, and which has the contact um, information below. Contact them. Um, verify if the information, uh, if the load is still available. Um, if you need to negotiate, this is your time to negotiate the amount. And also um, verify if your particular um, box truck that um, your carrier has is um, would be suitable for this type of load. As I mentioned before, you can click on the review. You can also click on the docket number, which is the MC number. This will bring up the um, the broker information, the contact information, their um, address. Now, I also want to provide additional information for those who are having difficulties finding um, loads as a new carrier. Um, there's different, let me bring it up. There's several comp uh, companies that offered um, opportunities for contract carrier. Um, US PAC is one of them. So if you're starting out, you might want to look into these companies if you're having difficulty finding loads. Another company is 
laser ship. And also I will provide these links um, below my comments. And another one is Relay Amazon. And Amazon provides you the requirements in order to be a carrier for them. Now, if you like this video, please do um, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. If you have any questions, please do ask. And you all have a good day.